What's up, Sombra? What's up? So we got Sombra and Fritz. We're commentating except between TKO, Dio, and TK Eddie in yeah, winners. Yeah, my old is shit. Huh? My, my, my old is shit. No, no. It, okay, you, sh you should be good. Um, You can't hear me, though, through the thing right now, which is weird. So Dio rocking the Lucina, who is his secondary. He uses versus... Um, uh, versus DDD. One of the characters he uses versus um, DDD, I don't know. At one point I thought he was going to try Snake versus DDD, I don't know. He, last time these guys played, oh sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. Nairmore? 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 Oh, nerf DDD, yeah, yeah. DDD definitely, um, I, I don't think it needs a nerf, but, what? The sus DI, I think just a little crash. That was the man, bro. And the immediate forward smash back. Dio gonna take that stock. Um, so in this matchup, it basically comes down to can Dio force Eddie off of the stage and ledge trap him? And Eddie has that comeback factor. He's got a lot of great tools to just completely destroy his competition. Um, that that fair on the Gord is gonna hit him twice, and that was like 30 damage off the fair. That didn't even hit DDD. Okay, we're gonna see some ledge trap in here. Oh, not quite. Eddie's sneaking by. And Eddie throwing out that Gordo, but to no avail. Oh, nice up tilt. I think just any hit DDD gets in neutral is, is just great because DDD has that survivability and he doesn't really care how much damage he has. Alright, Dio probably hitting him. Yes. Yeah, you. It's very unintuitive for like a Lucina player to fight against Dio because um, Lucina has to stay so far away, like so much further away for a safe range than what she's used to because she's used to having that safeguard of the sword, but it doesn't save her very much when these hammers are massive and Gordo is such a the upbeat there could punish, but not really anything too great because if he doesn't kill any D D D. Eddie's gonna take that stock. Pummeling like a madman. Okay, Eddie doesn't mash, that's a fun fact. Eddie, Eddie does not mash. He doesn't he doesn't like it, I don't know why. You know I put all my uh, jump especially. Oh really? Works? On the D-pad? Yeah yeah. I, it does work. It, yeah, it's I really crazy. Think I about it. Situation actually happens. Mm -hmm. Um, this is scary. Wait, why doesn't he damage himself anymore? What the hell? Come at me. He's supposed to damage himself. Why isn't he damaging himself? But this is bullshit. Yeah, there. Okay, that was uh, so scary. Uh, man, did it. Sorry, I didn't mean to yell, but that was bullshit. Yeah. That was so scary. If I was, I, I would have gotten hit by that. I guarantee I would have gotten hit by that actually. The worst part is the. Uh, uh, yeah, the, it has high recovery, but it doesn't really it doesn't really matter because you shouldn't be using that move unless it's like okay. Have you seen it? Have you seen him do it on the ledge? No, no. He will try to two frame you with a fully charged side beat or whatever move that is. Down beat. Uh, anyway, we are taking the lead back, but at what cost? Because it doesn't really do much when. Dio cutting away a taunting MVM. Okay, he's gonna pump the shit out of him. Oh my god, oh my god. Yeah, yeah, if you fight Eddie, bro, just remember that. Oh my god, that was scary. And the ledge trapping? Okay, good stuff by Dio. Reflecting that Oh my god. This match is so close. Oh my god. No, that's not it. That was. Way weaker than I thought it was going to be, but is that it? No, he's living. If you do the, the three oh my god, the runoff fair. This is so close. Oh, oh. Is he going for the edge guard? I the, by the skin of his teeth and the, the star. Damn. That was insane. That whole exchange was so so close. And he's living. Yeah, yeah. Dude, did you see when Dio went off stage for that back air? He just barely missed. And the back air, not gonna take it. He's gonna run. I know, and Dio's not, not, not gonna put himself in a- No. no. That's gonna do it. Are we gonna see- This is the best of three. So, 
I'm just letting you know that we might see Eddie take another set off of Dio. That's gonna that's gonna hurt him. Uh, dude, Eddie's a menace. He's yeah. actually a menace. And everybody was sleeping on him. I, I, I've been saying this for months, bro. I've been saying this for months. I I said, fuck King DDD in Smash 4 and uh, that Eddie's a beast. And he's showing out right now. The second seed here. And, and who's taking sets off of him? King DDD. Dio's gonna, if, if, he, if Dio loses this set, this is the counter pick I was talking about. Snake, Snake versus DDD. I don't think this matchup's that great for Snake, though. Because of the projectiles, right? I mean, I, I just, I don't know. I just, I don't know. I think that his, Dio's logic is that it takes DDD so long to make it back to stage that, that if you can get set up as uh, Snake, then you can take it. But Mo says that Snake does not do well versus DDD, so. And he can absorb the projectiles, you're right. Anyway, some neutral shenanigans. I don't, know if the weird. I don't like this at all. I, I'm actually very uncomfortable. <laughs> What's going on? All right, Dio sitting up in his chair there. Oh yeah, my no. God! That hurt. That hurt to watch. And just dunking on him. I, Dio is, and he's making Dio look like like nothing. Yeah. This is like like round one scrub material for Eddie. I, I cannot believe I'm watching. And almost an entire stock ahead. This is not a good look. I really don't like uh, DDD's up. You don't like his up air? I think his up air is very easy to avoid. It's, it's situational. I, you, you just shouldn't be... I guess if you're playing a floaty character, you might find yourself in a position where you get to buy a nice Nikita usage. Yeah, but, maybe it's just a bad move. Oh yeah, I guess with Rosa, yeah, like floaty character is just like kind of hard to avoid that up air because it takes you so long to land. But yeah, yeah, I don't know. I haven't played with her. Right? Yes. Yeah. Um. Oh, up till missing. I don't know how. Damn. Oh, the gonna gonna survive that recovery situation, but literally an entire stock deficit for Dio here. He has to take this next stock. He doesn't have to, but he, he should very much want to take this next stock. And Nikita not quite going to take it. The up tilt missing. An up tilt desperately. Oh, the dash attack going to kill. 125%, but this is where I, I believe in Snake in this scenario. If he can hold on to this stock, 160%, he's highly damaged. But as I speak it, Dio loses that stock and things are not looking good. That's good. Eh, you can do um, you can do down throw up tilt at zero, and it's like 34. So that was eight percent. He just missed. Oh my god. Dio going for Q CQC, but then Nikita and like Bordo situations, and I don't know how I feel about it because that just got reflected. Look at that. Oh my god. It's, it's, it's I believe in Dio. I actually believe in him. But. It's just hard. It's very hard. I, he's, he's doing great right now. It's funny because I'm seeing this as an underdog situation when Dio's actually supposed to be like this set. It's just so weird. Dio, Dio doesn't really like DDD very much either. I, I disagree with the this, this snake pick. If he wins this match, then, then he might be pretty wrong. But Oh my god, that was a big rank play. He can absorb the up smash? What the fuck, dude? He's gonna be pissed as this That's a mix-up you save for later. I didn't know about that. Oh my god. Oh, okay, if, if Dio finds an up to you, Dio finds it, huh? And dunked on to win this at 2-0. Absolute destruction there by Eddie. Just so convincing in that set. Wow.